Spectrum. This is a big thing in running and can be a little controversial at times. Anytime a runner says, hey, I got pain on the outside of the knee, people pop up and are like, that's IT band syndrome. You need to foam roll and stretch the crap out of that. Scrape it, soft tissue and all that stuff. We now know that most of the time the issue isn't right here, it's up in the strength of the hips and the glutes um, that have to control the knee motion when landing while running. So it actually up here is the problem for the pain down there. So I'm gonna show you some exercises that help to strengthen this area. The first one is doing a clam. And this is a really common exercise, but super important as the first step to just to make sure that you're actually um, working on the right thing. So get in a sideline position, straighten your body all the way out. First thing I want you to do is just hold for 30 seconds. Make sure you're contracting the glutes. And then after you hold for 30 seconds, do 20 reps. And I would do it twice on all each right. side. The second exercise that I want you to do for IT band syndrome, which is the key to this, as I said before, is to help strengthen the hips and the glutes, is kind of a side plank variation. It's basically what I call a side plank, but for your hips. So you're gonna get in side lying like this, go up like as if you're going to do a side plank, squeeze the glutes to push your hips forward. And then I want you to actually lift this, lift this side while lifting this up. And you can start by just holding. And then to make it a little harder, you can push your leg straight all the way out, or you can actually go up and down, okay? Just like this. You can also add a band if you would like to make it even a little bit harder, but you feel this on both sides. You'll feel it on the downside if you're lifting up and you'll feel it on that top side also. And again, this is kind of the next level past the clams and working this. All right, the next exercise in working the outside of the hips and the glutes for IT band syndrome is the good old band walk. So what you're gonna do is put the band around your feet. This gets the most activation because it's lower down, longer lever arms. We're going to band walk over here by the espresso machine here at Mission Move. So you want to get into just a little bit of knee bend forward a little bit, butt out. And then you're just going to take one step followed by another step. Always keep the feet about the same distance apart. Don't cheat by taking really big steps. and Don't cheat by taking little tiny steps where your feet get close together. And what you want to do is do about 30 seconds to a minute one direction and then do 30 seconds to a minute the other direction. All right, give that one a try.